This coding question was given during one of my interviews for a 180k software engineer position. So given a connected undirected graph, we turn the deep clone off the graph. Let's say we're given this graph, if we perform a deep clone, we get the following. So the structure stays the same, but the nodes are new. Let's go over the dog process. We will start off by cloning the initial node, and then we can perform a depth search on the neighboring nodes to clone all the connected nodes. Now this is a side case that we need to handle. So let's say we finish cloning node 1 and currently at node 2. After cloning node 2, we will need to visit the neighboring nodes. We may visit a node that has already been cloned before. That means we will need a way to keep track of previously cloned nodes. What we can do is to create a hash map to keep track of the node and the clone of the node. Let's implement the function clone graph taking the input node, return the result of the helper method. Now let's implement the helper method taking the node and our map. If node is node return node, if map contains our node return the clone version, create a clone of our node, put the node and our clone into our map, iterate through the neighbors, recursively clone the neighbor and then add it to our neighbors list, and then we can return the clone node.